Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be showing you all how to make a custom HUD for your Fortnite Creative 2.0 map. Now it's actually really easy to do and has lots of potential. So let's get started. First thing you want to do is find where you want to locate your HUD. So we're going to put it right into here. I made a folder. You want to right click and find the user interface and go to widget blueprint. Click on user widget. We're going to name it UI underscore tutorial. And then you want to click into it. Once you're in it, what you want to do is drop down a canvas panel. There are other options. This one seems to be a lot better and it has more options and customization to it. And then once you're here, this green box here is basically everything that's on the screen. So whatever you want to add to it, you can add whatever you want. So I actually have an image here. What I'm going to do, what you want to do is locate the image and simply drop it into it. Pretty cool. Now we can resize it here. I'm just going to like literally throw it under the screen. I'm not doing anything special. There's obviously a lot more things you guys can do with this. I'm not really going to go over any of that in this video. It's kind of up to you for what your map is. Next, what we're going to do is go up to UEFN text block. We're going to put in some text here. So the edit the text, you want to go down to content text, and then we're going to name it hello boom really cool you'll notice here we can't actually resize it like this what you want to do is you want to go down the font and click on size you can actually you know boost that way up here take this green box and make it go over it so you can move it around here but that's that let's make it a bit smaller so it's not massive uh let's do that we'll move them right here and again you guys can do a lot more with this i'm just showing you guys how to add images and text onto it but next you want to do is go up to compile and then you'll see what you did right in here next thing we're going to do is find the hud message device drop it into your map the two main settings you're going to want to change is show on round start yes and change the time for round start to zero. So right as soon as it starts the game, this will actually pop up on screen. And then display time, we're going to turn this off here. So show for duration, turn it off so it will display throughout the whole game. And then under HUD widget, we're going to change this to our UI that we just made. It's right down here. UI tutorial, we just made it. Now we're gonna test it out. But before you actually test it, what you wanna do is make sure you have HUD scale on 100%. If you don't have it on 100%, it's actually gonna be different from what we can see in the editor, and it's gonna be either zoomed in or zoomed out, whatever you have it. If you guys wanna have better experiences from now on in Creative 2.0 maps, I would suggest just keeping the HUD scale on 100%. I used to have it on 75, but once you start playing Creative 2.0 maps, you're gonna notice that the images are either zoomed in or zoomed out. They're not gonna look good if you don't have it on 100 percent just try to adjust having the, the hud on 100 percent from now on all right and here we go you'll see here the custom hud is working this is real pretty cool and that's that hope you guys enjoyed this video if this did help you guys be sure to subscribe for more videos like this i will be pushing out more uefn tutorials very soon if you did miss the other ones be sure to check them out i will have a playlist in the description down below be sure to check them out and i'll see you guys in another uefn tutorial Bye bye